Mutation is a change in the base sequence of an organism's DNA. Because the base sequence of DNA determines the base sequence of mRNA, and the base sequence of mRNA, in turn, determines the order of amino acids in a protein, some mutations alter the structure and function of proteins. Such changes can sometimes lead to severe diseases. For example, a single mutation in the gene for hemoglobin causes sickle cell anemia. Thousands of different diseases derive from mutations in thousands of different genes. Common types of mutations are base substitution mutations, silent mutations, and premature stop codons. Here you see part of the AT3 mRNA. These 12 RNA bases encode four amino acids in the heart of the AT3 protein. tRNAs bring the four appropriate amino acids to the ribosome, where they are added to the growing protein chain. A base substitution is a common kind of mutation and at the level of nucleic acids the most subtle kind. One base is exchanged for another in the DNA and the change is transcribed into RNA. Here A was substituted for a G in codon 129 of the AT3 gene. The normal 129th codon CGA encodes arginine. In families with a substitution converting this codon to CAA the amino acid glutamine is placed in this position instead. The amino acid alteration changes the shape of the AT3 protein so that it doesn't work as well in preventing clots. People with this mutation are prone to dangerous blood clots in their blood vessels. Many mutations have no effect at all because the genetic code is redundant. In other words, different codons can code for the same amino acid. Here in the third base of codon 129, a G is substituted for an A. The substitution has no effect on the protein sequence, since CGG codes for arginine just as CGA does. This is called a silent mutation. Some substitutions convert a codon into a stop codon, either UAA, UAG, or as in this case, UGA. Here a C in the 129th codon of the AT3 gene was mutated to a U. The change leads to a UGA in the message, and this in turn leads to the synthesis of an abnormally short and non-functional AT3 protein. The protein synthesized is too short to do its job of preventing blood clots. This can lead to blood clots and in some cases, even death.